Hey guys, this is a sad day. Um, I just learned that uh, Levin had, has obviously passed away and I'm very sad. I didn't know him personally though, but uh, yeah, he was a great metal detector, he was a great guy as far as I know and uh, Levin I will miss you and uh, I'll always remember you. All right, my first find is a, is a nice one. It's uh, one silver groschen, one silver groschen, 1852, and it seems in very good condition. All right, moving on. This is strange. This is strange because uh, obviously some other detectorist was here and uh, so he did close his holes but he left all the trash in the holes and um, yeah so um, I don't like that if you are detecting please take your trash look here here take it with you man all right, moving on. And I'm getting angrier and angrier. Uh, you know, these are all the holes from my fellow detectorist friends and he just threw his trash in the, inside the holes and left. And he didn't cover it with some leaves and nothing. But he was a stupid... Uh, he was a stupid fuck. Because, look, this is his holes, here's my rucksack, and here I just discovered a very beautiful coin. I never found something like that before, I heard of them. Look at that, it's a guess, it's a bronze coin. I'll lay it there, that should be alright to focus. It's uh, three Pfennig, the mint mark is A, but I'm doubt it's Berlin because on the other side it's uh, it has a crest of Saxony uh, Frederick no no Fürstentum Duke Ness or something like that um, yeah no it's not Saxony it's Fürstentum Schwarz, something. Um, I'll show you in a photo, as usual. But that's a really beautiful coin, and it's from 1846, by the way. So, this dumb ass uh, just dug the trash and left the good stuff in the ground. So. It's good, but you know, actually, this is my permission here. Uh, I talked to the landowner and he gave me permission to do it. Uh, but he clearly told me uh, to fill all my holes and to take all the trash I'm able to carry, sometimes it's very big, to carry with me. So uh, I'm doing this thoroughly. So I'm very annoyed by someone else getting here and uh, behaving like shit. So whoever you are, if you're watching this, don't do this again. Be so decent and take your shit with you. Thank you. Moving on. This is incredible. Look, the next silver groschen from 1871. Um, and, you know, if you look at the big tree over there, you can see the disturbed earth. Uh, these are two holes of my fellow friend. And then, uh, no, not, he must have gotten one decent target. And in the other holes, there was the trash. And he left this one. This is a, a copper nut or brass. So, uh, whoever dug there, 
and watch is this this is not so common so you know so please take your trash with you all right um, but this was a beautiful find the second for today second silver woohoo Woohoo! Another silver, but this one is too far gone to say what it is. But I guess it's another silver groschen. And man, the other guy, he was stupid as hell. Look at that. Here is a hole of him where he dug that and left it. I'm gonna take it. And here is my hole where I found a beautiful silver coin. Listen to the sound. Yeah, it's silver. I can see some riding around the 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 rim, but no, can't make out any detail. But this will clean up, and uh, I will be able to say you what it is. I'm glad there are stupid people out there. All right, moving on. And a really beautiful coin popped up. It's a tube fennec from 1863. And it's from, uh, let me see, 181 Thaler. Um, oh, this is Brandenburg or Prussian? I don't know. But it's an eagle. Shut up. It's an eagle in a crest with a crown on top. <laughs> I'm here perhaps one and a half hours and I've found so far uh, three silvers and two bronze coins which are very beautiful. I've never found uh, a coin like that before, not uh, two or three pfennig. Oh, amazing! And this plain place has been uh, hunted before, uh, recently, so <laughs> lucky me. Or, oh, yeah, you know. Alright, to the next one. This is amazing. Look what popped up now. Haha, <laughs> it's a pin of a German steel helmet. Um, a very nice one. Um, I clean it a bit and show you. <laughs> I guessed something like that. There's inscription on it and it's reading Der Stahlhelm. And here's the little thingy from the hook or the catch, I don't know. But Der Stahlhelm was the so-called uh, Freikorps. After the Versailles Treaty, Germany was forced to uh, downgrade its army to uh, just 100,000 men. Um, a lot of soldiers and officers from the First World War um, couldn't cope with that and they uh, unified themselves or they, they put themselves together in so-called Freikorps. It's a free uh, paramilitary uh, organization and uh, the most known, for me at least, was Der Stahlhelm. Um, they were involved in, in uh, putting down the revolution 1918-1919. So I guess it's from that time frame. This is an extraordinary find. I'm so happy with that. Whoa! And you can see still a little bit uh, gold gilt left. So I guess this would clean very nicely. You will see it in the picture right after this footage. Moving on. Well, that's a first for me. This is... what do you think? It's uh, aluminum. There's something like a brand sign or something. 
Well, I can't decipher it yet, but it's uh, what I guess a pre-war or a GDR, I don't know, because it's aluminum. It's lipstick. Wait, I show you. I prove it. And uh, there's still something inside, so uh, one could paint his lips with it. If one would like. But this looks like brass and it's hmm. Don't know, perhaps with a with a brand sign I can research this. But anyway, that's a nice find first for me. Alright, moving on. Whoa! I think I found a Soviet uh, cap patch. You see, it's a little bit red. And oh, yes, it came in with nine. Oh, and the pin is still there. Okay, I clean it and show you. It came in with 90. But I doubt that it's silver, but let's check that. Hmm, unfortunately, there is not much to clean, and it's not silver. It's aluminum and the pin really is there it was attached to the cap but um, I guess the inlay was made of iron well, let's see how that cleans up you'll see a picture right after this one moving on This turns out to be a magnis magnis mag magnis magnificent magnificent hunt. I found a this time it's one Groschen. Groschen, it's from 1858. It has a beautiful crest on the other side. And you know it's kind of silver shiny. So even if it's not written on silver Groschen. I bet it is silver. Ooh, my fourth one today. Quadruple silver. Ah, I'm not sure if I had it before. Alright, moving on. This hunt definitely will go uh, into my metal detecting history look at that my fifth coin my fifth silver coin and this is 20 Pfennig 1875 imperial era and uh, era and this one is 90% silver not that it's you know much uh, has big value or something like that but it's a very beautiful coin to the next. Uh, you won't believe this. Uh, right now I've found another silver, which makes it six for today. You can see it clearly, uh, the, the, the right edge. I scraped a little bit here and it comes silverish through. I guess it's half a silver groschen, but uh, I'm not sure. I will uh, show you in a picture. All right, moving on. <laughs> 